grew up in Brooklyn. Uh, great neighborhood. Great area. Um, I grew up where everyone knew everyone else. And um, it, it's different. I was able to go out early in the day, play all day, come home for dinner. And uh, there wasn't that, that feeling of danger, even though, even though you would think Brooklyn was like that. But the, I, there was no sense of that. My mom and dad both worked, hardworking people, and, um, and, I, and, and a sense of family. I mean, no matter, no matter where we were, at 6 o'clock, the whole family, no matter what, was home for dinner. Um, so that, that was very valuable. Years later, now I realize how valuable that sense of family is. My father loved music. 50s music, he'd always have. Les Paul and Mary Ford. I think I got turned on to music um, How High the Moon, Bye Bye Blues, all those old Capitol records by Les Paul and Mary Ford. It was always amazing. And my father, you know, was a big fan of Les Paul. And he would tell me, you know, that's all multi-tracking. And he'd explain to me what multi-tracking was. I, you know, I was a little kid not understanding. You know, and I'd hear Mary Ford and I'd be like, but she sounds like there's four of them. It sounds like there's four or five singers. And, and, and he would say, well, no, it's her tracking again and again and again. So I was fascinated by that. And, and, and the wall of sound to today even, when you listen to an old record like that, it just sounds glorious.